people living in and visiting Florida means heavier traffic, which in turn creates higher levels of noise, especially in urbanized areas. One of the ways the Florida Department of Transportation, FDOT, addresses highway traffic noise is by building a noise barrier, commonly referred to as a noise wall. A noise wall effectively reduces the audible levels of traffic noise to affected properties, and many factors are taken into consideration to determine if a noise wall should be built. Sound is measured in decibels based on how the human ear interprets sound. For highway traffic noise, an adjustment is made to approximate the way an average person hears. This is called the A-weighted frequency scale. The level of highway noise is determined by several things the volume and the speed of traffic, and the number of trucks in traffic. FDOT performs a highway noise study when one or more of the following conditions exist. A new roadway is being considered, new travel lanes are proposed on an existing roadway, and or an existing roadway alignment will be significantly altered. When one or more of these conditions exist, FDOT will conduct a traffic noise study. This will be done in the initial phase of the roadway project to assess the noise levels and determine the need for a noise wall. Traffic noise Noise impact criteria set by the Federal Highway Administration is used in this study. Noise walls can be made of numerous materials but are primarily built with concrete. The texture and color of exterior surfaces may vary depending on the location of the wall and public input. These decisions are determined during the engineering design. In Florida, noise walls range from 8 feet to 22 feet, depending on the landscape or terrain conditions. The noise study process is designed to determine the most effective height to reduce noise and minimize the cost of construction. Noise walls can significantly reduce noise in nearby neighborhoods where there may be homes, schools, parks, and businesses. If the noise study determines a noise wall is needed, FDOT will contact residents and business owners to ask for input about building the noise wall in their area. As they say in the business world, it's all about location. Noise walls must be built in the roadway right-of-way outside of the clear zone, generally about five feet from the edge of the right-of-way. Existing vegetation and tree lines really don't reduce highway noise, and often vegetation must be cleared to accommodate a noise wall. As you can see, many factors are considered in determining the need for a noise wall. For more information on the analysis, consideration, and construction of roadway noise walls, contact the FDOT Planning and Environmental Management Office at 800-749-2967.